21 done went civil rights. Ain't that so? Put me on GQ. Thank you for having me. Obviously, an awful, awful day for our entire country. Yet another senseless tragedy right here at home. This is Daphne Evans. He done dropped out of school. It ain't nothing. He done got his first young black boy. Ain't out of front of sense of babies. Why you think we skip school and hang out on the pavement? Why you think we. I don't really have much to say, man. Uh, I don't really have much to say at all. 21 Savage um, dropped a new music video for the song Nothing New. The, so the video started off with Colin Kaepernick. Started off with statements by LeBron James. It started off with statements by Barack Obama. <sighs> These artists... <laughs> These rappers, they know, G. They're not stupid. They're not stupid. They know what kind of music. They know it's, they're not oblivious to what's happening in their communities. They know what's going on. The kind of music that they put out gets put out for a reason. Come on now. You think that like... <laughs> These rappers aren't stupid. I'm just saying. Yeah, people don't understand when, they, when, when we talk about the music that people digest on a daily basis that gets put out on radio. People are always complain about them using the B word and, and, and cussing and, and and talking about killing brothers and their music and you know the drug glorification. These artists aren't dumb. And the music that you hear that gets put out that's on my mouth. The music that you hear that gets put out is under contract. Y'all buying it. If y'all don't want to hear this music, don't buy the music. Matter of fact, these artists, if you want to be real, their, their say in a lot of what they get to do is very little. When you're under a contract, you have to put out stuff under that contract. And I'm not going to sit up here and act like I'm the, the king and uh, I know everything about the music industry. No, but... <laughs> These guys, they know, they, they're not oblivious to what's happening in their communities. And a lot of them want to, they're not stupid. They, they want to put out good music. They want to put out music that is uplifting. For Why would you want to talk about killing your own people and your own music? Like, that's just, uh, you think we're just that we done stupid. Well, they, these young black men, you know, they love talking about killing each other in their music. Like, we love to do that. Like, we, we love it. Like, we generally find satisfaction in telling, you know, hey, I want to kill, you know. No, come on, man. Like, that's kind of the kind of self-hating and racist rhetoric that 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 they continue to put people continue to put on these artists to demonize us. Ultimately, I believe. Um, but you know, um, I'm glad that 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 he look. I, I'm glad that he did this. Um, I will say the song wise, I'm you know I think I don't I I I, I right I, of course I don't want to hear this song every day, I I, I don't um I I don't want to uh, be sad all the time uh, with, with conscious music <laughs> I don't um and you know I I also think that out of the songs that he's put out this is probably one of his worst songs as far as like you know because I didn't you know I, I felt his I felt his substance I felt the lyrics he was saying but I didn't just like the the beat was simple, the music video was great. Uh, but you know, the song I won't, you know, won't be my t favorite 21 Savage song, but ultimately I think the point is that you can put out good music with great beats, fire, s swag, um, and put out bangers, party music, 
without in a certain way without having to you know degrade and and sell out your community in order to do that these kids at the end of the day they just want to feed their families man they they, they want to make money and that's it's a business it's called the music business for a reason and you know we got to hold if you're going to hold them accountable for the lyrics that get put out you also got to hold the con the contractors accountable for making them sign these certain agreements the, the requirements for them to have a contract and make money off this type of music so this this is not you know it's 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 all it's all connected you know what I mean the fact that a lot of these record labels have ties in with the prison industrial complex, Viacom, which owns a lot of TV networks with you know black music black black entertainment on it, is what one of the biggest buyers of the um, the CCA or was it the CAA or CCA, which is one of the main prison contractors in the United States. So, I mean, they own what? 65% of Viacom is owned by the CCA. Um, and these contract that uh, the CCA has done a contract with over 48 states to keep a 90% occupancy rate inside their prisons. So, that means, I mean, honestly, and this is, you can call it conspiracy, you can call it what you want it. Um, the music that gets put out is to promote people to get back into the jail, the jail system. So, I mean, I don't find that, um, I don't find it coincidental that these, <laughs> that these, you know, some of the, the songs that are going to put out are glorifying violence, glorifying crime. Glorifying underage sex, glorifying drug use, uh, glorifying, you know what I mean? Like, it's not, it's not, it's a, it, it, it's a complex system and there's definitely a lot of characters involved. So just blaming the artists are the people that are, that, that are the people who made it out to the point where now they're, they're known and they they are supposed to, they're, they're the prophets. They're supposed to speak the voice of the people and speak, tell, tell those who don't know, who are not, who have not made it, what's happening behind the scenes, what they've seen and what they've learned from their life and what you can do to help out yours. So, um, like I said, I didn't mean going to rant, but like, I appreciate the, the, the content and the lyrics that get put out by uh that were put out by 21 savage in this one so um it'll be interesting to see how his career happens ch changes after this because this was a conscious 21 savage song we know what he can do now uh will he go back to the old 21 or will he uh be you know this new 21 which is like oh i'm a little fiasco all of a sudden <laughs> <laughs> yeah. if 21 goes lupe fiasco i'm gonna be dead <laughs> i'm going to cry <laughs> His next song is going to be like, <laughs> it's not going to be called 21 Savage. He ain't no Savage no more. He 21, he 21 activists, <laughs> 21 civil rights, <laughs> 21 ways to fight for freedom. 